Hey, happy new year. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to my first video of 2024. Uh, I hope you had a great Christmas uh, and new year. Uh, now we've got a really, really busy year ahead of us this year. We've already got a lot of conversions booked in over the next few months. Uh, and we do have some amazing campers available that are ready to drive away. Uh, so what I want to do in this video is I'm going to show you around our latest uh, VW camp that we've just completed. It was completed just before Christmas. Uh, if you follow us on YouTube and you uh, visit our website, you might have seen this van already. Uh, it's a 2022 VW T6.1 in pure grey. It's an automatic van with all the bells and whistles. It's got heated seats, it's got the 150 DSG uh, automatic gearbox. Uh, it's got a tailgate and it really is the ultimate uh, base vehicle for a camper. So in this video, I'm going to show you around the outside of the van, talk around the external modifications that we've done on the van. And then as usual, I will step inside here and I will talk you through all the color options that we've chosen uh, on this van. Uh, and this camper is now available to drive away. We are taking bookings for viewings. So if you are interested in this camper after I've done the walk around, make sure you get in touch because as soon as we get January out of the way, that's when the demand for camper starts to really go up. Uh, so any camper that we've got will be sold pretty quickly but also make sure you hang around until the end of the video because i am going to also talk about one of the camper that we've got available ready to drive away which is in pure black uh, as well as another couple of campers that we've got in the pipeline which are going to be ready in the next few weeks so make sure you hang around until the end of the video and i'm going to get started with the walk around i'll see you outside okay so here we are so as i said this is a uh, 2022 vw t6.1 it's a highline model okay and the color is called pure gray uh, and this is quite a popular color we actually converted one last year in pure gray and it sold very very quickly so it is all the gray colors on the campus are really really popular uh, and i think it looks great once it's had the conversion uh, so this particular campus had our platinum package uh, so i'll just quickly walk you through what you get in the platinum package so it's had the uh, 20 inch wolf race alloy so they're brand new uh, alloys brand new tires uh, we have lowered the van by 40 millimeters just to give it a, a slightly lower look and just to help you get into garages and car parks uh, we fitted the matte uh, black uh, sidebars as you can see which does really improve the lines of the van at the side and then also we fitted the uh, gloss black uh, front splitter uh, which you can see at the bottom of the bumper there and we've also blacked the badges on this van as well so we've actually uh, took the silver badges off the van uh, and put on uh, the black badges which i think really does improve uh, the look of this van and as you can see from the front it looks absolutely great so i'll just walk around this side so you can see this side of the van so all our campers have privacy glass uh, windows all around the van um, it's got an opening window on the kitchen side so the uh, the window on the other side does open up uh, above the kitchen and then on this side on the passenger side we have fitted a remo awning rail which runs all the way down the passenger side as you can see uh, it's really really stealth you can't really see it uh, but that does fit virtually all awnings and canopies and that is part of the platinum package. So I've just come around to the back of the van. So this van is a tailgate and we fitted the colour coded rear spoiler on the back, which is, again is part of the platinum package. Uh, and then we've blacked the badge at the back there as well. So what I'll do is I'll just uh, open up the tailgate and just show you the rear of uh, the van as well. Okay, so here we are. So this is the back of the rock and roll bed and you've got a nice big storage space which runs underneath the rock and roll bed right from the back of the, of the van here right to the front, which I'll show you when I get inside the van. You've got a, a nice big wardrobe cupboard at the back here or the back of the wardrobe. Uh, where you can store things in there it's a good sized space and then you've also got another cupboard at the bottom here where we store the leisure battery but you've got quite a bit of space in there as well uh, to store things uh, but this cupboard and all this space under here is the biggest space under the van you've got a nice big area under there to put things which goes right to the front of the bed uh, which is like i said really good for storage and then again because it's had the platinum package we have fitted van chaise blinds on all the windows uh, so you've got one on the back window here on the on the tailgate and then you've got blinds uh, on both sides of the van, two on that side and then one just over the kitchen area which I'm going to show you uh, in a minute. Okay, so what I'll do now is I'm going to jump inside of the van and I'm going to show you all of the spec and the, the colours that we've chosen for uh, this particular camper. We did choose all the spec on this. Uh, usually we will sell a base vehicle uh, before we've uh, converted it so the customer can choose all the spec. But on this particular van it came up and we just had to buy this so we actually chose all the spec ourselves so we could get it converted and, and ready for sale uh, for our customers. Just before I get inside I'll just tell you about the roof. So this is a West Dubs roof. We fit West Dubs roofs to all of our campers. They're really really good quality. They've got a five-year warranty. Uh, so this van has got a black uh, canvas which is a scenic canvas. So as you can see it actually pulls right back. The canvas can tie up uh, so it opens up the full roof which is a really really nice extra which we really like on a camper i think it's well worth having that scenic canvas uh, to open up get plenty of air into the van and plenty of light it just adds another dimension and then we've put a black roof top on it just to contrast all the rest of the black on the van which i think looks absolutely great uh, okay so what i'll do then i'll jump inside and i'll show you the interior we 
we are. Okay, so here we are inside of the van. So I'm just going to talk you through all the colour options that we've gone for. Now this furniture colour is the first time we've used this particular furniture colour. So we thought we'd step outside our comfort zone a little bit and, and spec something a little bit different. Uh, but again, on these videos, it is hard to portray colours exactly. Uh, but the colour of this furniture is called Seaside Blue. So it's a very, very light shade of blue. And if I just come back a little bit and get some light on it, you can see that it is a very sort of light blue colour. And it matches really well with the pure grey of the van. Because the van's a matte grey, uh, it has got a tinge of blue to it and we thought that the furniture matched it really really well and then we've gone for the black trim so we've put black handles uh, black uh, edging on the on the wardrobe and we've also put a black tambour door on there uh, and also a black uh, table leg as well just to go with the rest of the uh, upholstery and furniture okay and then with regards to the upholstery we've gone for the black schwartz upholstery which we do spec a lot in our vans because we really do like this color a lot of our customers like it and we've gone for a light gray stitching uh, and also vw logos in the headrest which i think look really nice they match the furniture really well and also the exterior of the van and then the van shades blinds i think are called slate so they are kind of a darkish gray color which I, which again contrasts really well with the furniture and looks really good with this particular seating and, and full setup and then of course we've gone for the solid oak worktops and table uh, which we do on most of our campers these days Days. Uh, most of our customers like the solid oak. It just elevates the interior a little bit and gives it a bit more quality inside. Uh, so let us know what you think to the interior of the van. Uh, we'd love to know what your thoughts are on this seaside blue colour. I personally love it. I think it looks absolutely great uh, against that pure grey uh, on the external of the van. And then the outro flooring is called Dolphin, so it's a light grey colour, uh, which again does go well with the furniture. It contrasts really well. Uh, and now this camper did come with a double seat, so we did have a double passenger seat when we bought the van, but we decided to take the double out and we've actually replaced it with a single seat. So we've put a single captain passenger seat in and then fitted a swivel to that as well. Then obviously matched the driver's seat to that as well. So the seats at the front match the rock and roll bed uh, upholstery. So you've got a double rock and roll bed there, which pulls down flat and will uh, sleep comfortably to uh, adults. And then you've also got uh, a double bed in the pop top roof as well, which pulls down on gas struts. Uh, so it is a four berth van and will comfortably sleep uh, for adults. And then as usual you've got the Dometic fridge freezer so you've got a decent sized freezer compartment and fridge uh, you've got the double gas burner and the cold water sink there as well and then because it's had the uh, platinum package we have fitted a diesel heater so all of our gold platinum and platinum plus packages do come with a diesel heater uh, we only use very good quality heaters this is a Webasto heater uh, it's not the cheap Chinese stuff it's a really really good quality heater it's EU regulated uh, and we never ever have any problems with these diesel heaters and then you'll see the little outlet down there behind the driver's seat that lets all the warm air out there for the diesel heater so, so this van is perfect to use all year round you can literally use this in winter when it's freezing cold you've got a lovely cozy little living area in there with a diesel heater uh, so you don't just have to use it in the summer you can use it all year round uh, which is what a lot of our customers are looking for okay so what i'll do is i'll just quickly show you in the driver's area and just talk through uh, some of the features on the actual van itself okay so this is like i said a, a t6.1 it's a 22 plate it's done less than 10,000 miles it's done 9,900 miles it's got about two years vw warranty on the van so anything that goes wrong with the van in the next two years vw will obviously sort that problem out this is a seven speed dsg gearbox okay so a lot of our customers are looking for automatics they are a lot more expensive than the manuals but if you are looking for a nearly new base vehicle with an automatic gearbox then this could be perfect for you uh, because it's the high line it's got everything on it it's got the adaptive cruise control air conditioning heated front screen electric mirrors uh, front and rear parking sensors and this particular van has also got heated seats so you've got heated uh, passenger and driver seat in this van which just gives it another little level of quality in the front uh, especially in the winter months so you can keep warm so this van has essentially got everything on it it does drive like a car it's really really comfortable to drive so if you are looking for a luxury camper on a nearly new base vehicle this could be a really good option for you and we also fit a new mat to all of our campers so you've got a black mat in the front there with the, with grey piping to match the van but as I said before all the seats have been upholstered in the black Schwartz with the grey stitching uh, to match the rock and roll bed okay so that's it for the walk around of this amazing camper and as I said at the beginning of the video this camper is available to drive away it is very rare that we have completed campers that are not sold because we normally sell base vehicles uh, as a package and then we work with the customer to choose all the spec and extras and everything but we know from previous years that once we get january out of the way the demand for campers goes up significantly so we wanted to have some campers on the shelf ready to go so this one is available for viewing now at our sales office so if you are interested in this pure gray camper do let us know as soon as you can because i don't think it's going to hang around for long uh, all you need to do is go to our website which is highlifecampers.co.uk go to the contact page and send us a message or just give us a call and we can talk through the details and arrange a range of viewing 
Now we do have another camper which is ready to drive away, which is a pure black T6.1 Highline with a tailgate. It's a 150 horsepower manual gearbox on that van uh, and the spec inside is absolutely beautiful and you can see all details of that van on our website. If you just go to the sales page on, uh, on our website, you'll see details of the black van and also all the details of this particular van as well. And we also have another couple of campers under construction. We have a, an Ascot Grey van being delivered next week. Uh, we've chosen all the spec for that. Uh, so I'll put some pictures up of that van on the screen now. And we also have a two-tone camper coming through in the next couple of weeks. So it's going to be a copper bronze two-tone. And we've chosen a really nice spec on this van. And you can find out all the details of that two-tone van and also the Ascot Grey van on our website as well. Just go to the sales page. Now, if you haven't already subscribed to our YouTube channel, make sure you do that because I do share regular information videos covering all sorts of topics about VW campers. So if you are a newbie to VW campers and you want to get your questions answered, uh, make sure you subscribe and also go and check out all my previous videos. We've got over 100 videos on the channel now, uh, so you'll probably find answers to your questions. So make sure you subscribe, and if you've got value from this video and you've enjoyed the content, please also consider hitting that like button, and I will see you in the next video. Speak soon.